Let's take a look at the 2013-14 America East Women's Basketball Preseason Coaches Poll. At number nine are the UMass Lowell Riverhawks. We're really excited and honored to be in the America East and um, certainly a lot of challenges ahead, but mostly just a feeling of excitement and uh, trying to build this thing. The number eight pick are the Binghamton Bearcats. You know, young again, young but with a little experience, you know, experience at the point guard position with Stephanie Jensen back, Venetia Paul back, um, both of them have been handling the basketball for us. Pick seven are the UMBC Retrievers. Tim Hall is our new AD and has got us going in an incredible direction and uh, the university announced uh, the, you know, we're going to break ground on a new arena in 2015 to open in 2017 so it's an exciting time for UMBC. In the number six slot are the main Black Bears. We're healthy and uh, we're still young, you know, a lot of, a lot of freshmen and sophomores, uh, ten of our players are, are you know, underclassmen. But, uh, but we've got some experience now in that group, and we're looking forward to, you know, building on it. Selected fifth are the Vermont Catamounts. I think this season uh, will be about balance and about depth for us. And I don't think we have any real star, but we've got a lot of people who can do different things, and I think anybody could be our leading scorer on any given night. In the number four slot, are the New Hampshire Wildcats. Back to back years now we, when we graduated Denise mm -hmm. and now Morgan Frame and Carrie Reed. So this is going to be a big year for us. Um, we're, we're young, we have a lot of youth. Um, but you know what, I say that and some of our juniors now have had some good experience. Um, so we bring back Kaylee Kilpatrick, Kelsey Hogan, Elizabeth Belangers. The number three pick are the Stony Brook Seawolves. We have um, seven newcomers this year, um, five freshmen and two transfers. Um, and, and like you said, it's it's a process. You know, we are we're building a program. Um, I'm excited about the new faces that we have, and and also um, really interested to see how we we mesh with some of our you know returning players. You know, coming in the number two spot are the Hartford Hawks. You know, this team is hungry in a different way. They've they're you know two years of not winning. And that's a long time for players at Hartford and I think that they're hungry in a different way in terms of understanding what's expected of them and wanting to get back to that, that top spot and um, this is probably as motivated as, as we've been in three years. The number one pick in the women's basketball preseason coaches poll are the two-time reigning champion Albany Great Danes. Obviously we're excited because it's like a new page and it's kind of new energy, new leadership and um, obviously Sarah Royals is back. She's Played and started for two years already for us as a point guard, and we got Trusha Richards, and we got Megan Craig, and we got a lot of players that played a lot of minutes. So obviously, it's not going to be Ab and Julie, and everybody's not going to see that red hair flying in the wind anymore. <laughs> you know, getting those rebounds, but I'm sure Sharissa will. 